Well, one of the most widely used types of antacids in America is being associated with the development of dementia in a new study. Dr. Frank McGeorge is here with the details, but more importantly, the much wider range of concerns over this type of medication and yeah. why you should only take it when it really truly is necessary, Doc. That's just it, Kim and Devin. So we're talking about proton pump inhibitors. These are a powerful class of medication that blocks acid production in your stomach. Now, there are several brands like Prilosec, Nexium, and Prevacid that are even available over the counter, which might make you think that they're extra safe. But decades of research is finding more than a few long-term effects. The most recent study published in the journal Neurology found people 45 years and up who used prescribed proton pump inhibitors for more than four and a half years had a 33% higher risk of developing dementia than people who never took the drugs. The study doesn't say they cause dementia, only that there is an association that needs further study. Proton pump inhibitors are commonly prescribed short-term to treat gastroesophageal reflux disease, known as GERD, in addition to peptic ulcer disease. Common trade names you may know include Prilosec, Nexium, Prevacid, Asifex, and Protonix. Henry Ford Health gastroenterologist Dr. Amit Bond says, take care how you use them. Proton pump inhibitors were sort of a victim of their own success. They, they work so well, uh, and we know now that uh, they're not intended for over-the-counter long-term use, definitely. Proton pump inhibitors are generally considered safe, but there is mounting research suggesting they increase the risk of a number of medical problems, including osteoporosis, kidney problems, intestinal C. diff infections, pneumonia, cardiovascular disease, and dementia. If someone doesn't want to take proton pump inhibitors, they, there are a variety of options, which include H2 blockers such as Pepsid, famotidine, uh, uh, formulations of Zantac, or even uh, Tums, uh, calcium carbonate, uh, Rolids, uh, or Rolades and uh, diet and lifestyle modifications. Now here's the bottom line. As I always say, if something has an effect, it's gonna have a side effect. Proton pump inhibitors are great medications, and if you need them, even long-term, you should not be afraid to use them under a doctor's supervision. But over the counter, I would say, avoid popping them like candy until lo more long-term research is done. Back to you. Hey, Dr. McGeorge, thank you.